Medical Terminology, Lesson 12. The omentum is located in front of the abdomen and is part of the peritoneum. It is made up of fat and hangs over the intestines. Its purpose is to keep them warm. The abdominal cavity is also known as the abdomen. The spinal cavity is also known as the spinal canal. It is the space within the spinal column that contains the spinal cord. The diaphragm separates the abdominal and thoracic cavities. This muscle moves up and down, which helps in breathing. Membranes cover and protect organs. The peritoneum surrounds the abdominal viscera, liver, small intestines, large intestines, and stomach. The pleura covers the lungs. The periosteum protects the bones. The meninges surround the brain and spinal cord. Homophones. Plural and plural are homophones, meaning they sound alike though they are spelled differently and have two different meanings. Plural, P-L-E-U-R-A-L, membranes surrounding the lungs. Plural, P-L-U-R-A-L, means more than one. The abdominal pelvic area is divided into nine regions. The abdominal pelvic diagram is divided according to a patient's right and left. If you are facing the patient, their right lumbar region will appear on your left, but it is their right. However, you will call it the right lumbar region. Be sure not to confuse this. Surgeries being performed on the wrong side of the body have probably resulted from this mistake. Right hypochondriac region. The right hypochondriac region is the upper right region below the cartilage of the ribs that spread over the abdomen. The term hypochondriac, when you break it down, literally means pertaining to below the cartilage. The prefix hypo means below. The combining form chondro means cartilage. The suffix eac means pertaining to. The left hypochondriac region is the upper left region under the rib cartilage. The epigastric region is the area above the stomach. The right lumbar region is the middle area on the right near the waist. The left lumbar region is the middle area on the left near the waist. The umbilical region is the navel area, also called the umbilicus. The right iliac region is also known as the right inguinal region. It is the lower region on the right that is near the groin. The groin is the area where the legs join the torso of the body. The combining form inguino means groin. The left iliac region is also known as the left inguinal region. It is the lower region on the left that is near the groin. The regions are called iliac because they are near the ilium, which is the top portion of the hip bone. The hypogastric region is the middle section below the umbilical region. Hypogastric literally means pertaining to below the stomach. The prefix hypo means below. The combining form gastro means stomach. The suffix ic means pertaining to. Quadrants. The abdominal pelvic area is also divided into four quadrants. Like the regions, quadrants are divided according to a patient's right and left, not your right and left when facing them. The right upper quadrant contains the right lobe of the liver, the gallbladder, part of the pancreas, and parts of the small and large intestines. The abbreviation for this quadrant is R-U-Q. The left upper quadrant contains the left lobe of the liver, stomach, spleen, parts of the pancreas, and parts of the small and large intestines. 
The abbreviation for this quadrant is LUQ. The right lower quadrant contains part of the small and large intestines, appendix, and right ureter. In females, it also contains the right ovary and right fallopian tube. The abbreviation for this quadrant is RLQ. The left lower quadrant contains parts of the small and large intestines and the left ureter. In females, it also contains the left ovary and left fallopian tube. The abbreviation for this quadrant is LLQ.